Hello friends, my name is Radha Masood. Today we shall discuss about the topic the monopoly method in the Scrum framework or Agile methodology. Friend, uh, today's topic is very interesting and very important with respect to the implementation of uh, IT or software related projects and this is a method which we use to prioritize the requirement actually. So uh, friend, let's uh, start. First of all, I would request to please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell option as well so that my new videos can reach to you. So let's uh, start friend. First of all, we have to understand that monopoly money method is basically a method which we used in the a Scrum methodology to implement the project. Basically, a Scrum is a framework which we use to implement the software IT related projects in which we it is based on the iterative agile based approach in which we, which we divide the project into multiple chunks which is called a sprint and a sprint uh, we deliver the project to a uh, customer in multiple sprints actually. So now, uh, friend, uh, coming towards our main topic, monopoly money method is basically it is a method which we use to prioritize the product backlog. First of all, now what is product backlog? Product backlog it is the uh, scope document which contains all the user stories. Now, what is user story? User story is a functional requirement. Uh, like for example, if you are implementing e-commerce solution so and uh, you want that customer can do the payment through credit card for example so it's a user story okay and um, product backlog means that uh, it can it's just think of this as a excel document or word document which has all the user stories required for the for the implementation of a product okay now what is monopoly money method Monopoly many method we when we are when we need to prioritize the product backlog we uh, use one methodology one approach called as monopoly money method in this approach uh, which works well in give in is giving sponsors monopoly money equ uh, equaling the project budget and asking them to distribute it amongst the system features this is a uh, useful for gaining general priority on system components but can be taken too far if applied to question perceived low value add activities like documentation so keep it for the business feature basically uh, friend like high level features like customer can uh, like for example product character catalog uh, customer payments uh, the uh, other business features like so uh, what we do like uh, for example if you have a budget project budget of for example five thousand dollar is, is your budget of project so what you can do take the same uh, fake money or monopoly money okay and give it to your sponsor uh, this project sponsor and say to uh, for example you have five features are available for example uh, let's suppose uh, payments uh, customer sign up and uh, customer catalog product backlog etc so product catalog so what you can do like you have a list of features which are which will be available in the product and you give a fake money to the project sponsors okay and then ask them to uh, s to mention that how much money they want to spend on the uh, on the available features now what is the purpose of whole uh, this activity actually basically by using this methodology we want to understand the priority and the uh, uh urgency level of uh, proprietization level of a project sponsor we want to understand that how much money they want to spend on the product feature like for example if a customer is spending for example uh, one thousand dollar on one feature let's suppose and um, he is spending he is spending uh, let's suppose two hundred dollar on the other user story so obviously that means the uh, if customer is spending thousand uh, dollar on one story so obviously he has some priority for this story okay for this feature actually here remember that the uh, low level features like for example quality assurance uh, the uh, like documentation so these features will not be mentioned here because we are asking uh, the priority from the business uh, personnel uh, like project sponsors so we have to ask these questions from the uh, from the project sponsor only we have to mention the business features in the list so that they can answer it uh, easily or quickly actually so it's a, a monopoly money method it is a very easy method it is a very good method for uh, to get the prioritization from the 
project sponsors and uh, after receiving the project pr pr prioritization from the customer on the business feature we can prioritize the things accordingly it will become easier for us to prioritize the product backlog and uh, act accordingly so friend uh, thank you thanks a lot for watching the video i hope you like this video if like please share it with your friends and colleagues and thanks for watching the video thank you